So today is Wednesday the 24th of January, also known as payday. This has been a really long month, guys. I know everyone's been saying they feel the same, so I don't know if you guys have felt the same about it as well. Between Christmas and now, oh my gosh. There was too much month at the end of the money, definitely. Um, so today we are out running a few errands, paying a few bills, getting stuff sorted on payday. It's really miserable weather though, you can see. It's raining and uh, windy. It's really windy. It's not very nice. Um, but we will take you with us around town and see what we get up to. I think we're going to have Subway for lunch because it's payday. And I, Brooke had Subway yesterday and I was really annoyed and I really wanted Subway. Um, but I didn't go out with her, so that was my karma. <laughs> I stayed at home. She left me, left me to lay in bed all day, guys. Yeah, I laid in bed all day yesterday. So I like out. a lazy person. I, had I, didn't, yeah. I didn't vlog yesterday because it was crazy busy. I was driving most of the day because I had to go to the and it was crazy busy. I've got tested, I've got glasses coming next week. Then I had to go to the bed of my mum because she looked like a brother's cat and she's been quite poorly. Then I went home and then didn't do a lot. And I was still sitting on the bed. I did have Subway and it was nice. Sorry, No. She had a lovely, it was like a, was it turkey you said? Or turkey, flatbread? flatbread. And I, it was like really good. So it sounded like 300 calories or something, which is amazing. Yeah. Being as like a Simfar shake is like 200 calories. So for the sake of 100 calories more, I know what I would prefer. Yeah. So this morning I've been good, I've had porridge for breakfast, Brooks had a shake, um, so we're going to go Subway. I'm still not in the next stone bracket, I've got a pound to go and it's stubborn. Why is it always the case? So before we went to America last year, I wanted to lose three quarters of a pound more because it would have taken me under the next stone bracket. Still haven't lost it, still haven't lost it. That last, I think it's a pound and a half for me, just hanging on there. Just doesn't yeah, want to move. We, I have lost ten pounds, and the yeah. guy's lost like eight. So you lost eighteen pounds, pounds between us in, in, since since the first of January. Yeah, so. so it's been like three and a bit weeks. That's pretty good, I think. Um. Anyway, we're just rambling on now. So uh, we're going to go town, and we will take our, you with us and see what we get up to. Subway. Show you our subway, see definitely. Ya. See ya. Subway, and we're having a tuna flatbread. Um, that's my favourite actually. I don't get any sauce in it though. I've just got a tiny bit of honey mustard just to try to taste. And a nice fruit chili. And then we've got our bank ones, haven't we? So now yep. we're going to Tesco to get some food shopping. We'll take you with us then. Yeah. We lied to you guys. We lied completely. We said it we was pouring with rain. It's been we hell. Distracted. We were we blown away. That's a bit of a We're sorry. And I just needed the splits in the kitchen. Basically, tights and lining. Li what, what is he? <laughs> Lino. <laughs> Lino is all. <laughs> I'm so. We, I needed the splits. My legs went. Basically, yeah. our Tesco's is right near the beach. It sounds very nice, but it's not when it's win winter. No, and it's raining and it's windy. We got oh my gosh. Blown away. And then he got blown out of the car, got blown back into the car. Brooke had to like pull the car up right outside the entrance to Tesco. So it was like, great. That was like it was like a supermarket sweep, but it was. packing it away version of. Oh. We're home. And I split the litter bag in the car. It got caught on the rail. You know the chair rail that moves the chair back and forth. Do you know what I mean, guys? So when I lift the litter bag up, I'm gonna do it upside down, sellotape it. It's gonna, it's be, gonna be hell. We've left it in the car. That's I just can't even deal with it. Right now. <laughs> That's tomorrow's problem. <laughs> Or maybe next week's problem. Next week. Well, we're we'll running out of lit, and we, have, we desperately have to go. And the house oh. smells of cat ye wheat. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, we'll make the cats bring it in. <laughs> yeah, why don't you guys go and pick it up? Oh. Anyways. Guys, I'm tired now. So we're going to put the shop in away, but we'll show, show you. So we've got quite a bit. And then obviously, got the big bag of cat litter that's like bloody 11 pounds. I've just a few bits in the car. But shopping. Quite a few bits for one half price, like the corn mints and the corn chicken was half yeah. price. So I got two big bags. And guys, I don't know if you've ever noticed this in supermarkets. When like so, the three hundred ba gram bag of corn mints was two pound, but the five hundred gram bag of corn mints was half price. So it was only one pound sixty. Yeah. So it was cheaper to get the bigger bag than it and was also, to get the smaller bag. The Tesco finest frozen sweet corn was a pound, but the Tesco value sweet corn was one pound fifty. It doesn't make sense, guys. Shop around. Look at the prices yeah. that are there because it Sometimes really bugs you me. You think that some brands are going to be cheaper. Actually, they may not be. And it's even like this. So I'm not advertising here, but 
this was half price. Not sponsored by. <laughs> we're not so- Guys, we're going to sponsors. <laughs> <laughs> this is half price. So this was cheaper than if you got like Tesco's own. And it cooks in a quicker time. And it tastes like... <laughs> so Uncle Ben, we love you. <laughs> Please sponsor us. <laughs> Subliminal messages. Please leave a comment. See you in a bit, guys. Good morning. Sorry about my hair. <laughs> it has just woken up. So I'm just about to make some breakfast. I've been asked to go into my old workplace. Well, I'm still employed by them, but I'm being, um, being seconded to study, as you guys probably know already. <clears throat> so my throat is a bit sore. I hope I'm not getting ill. But um, So yeah, they've asked me to come and do some extra shifts, which I'm going to do because we can do with the money. Um, we have plans coming up, so it's important to get as much money behind us as we can. So I can't really say no. Nicole's working anyway. So I thought, yeah, okay, I'll go and do it. It's only... Uh, Sorry, I've got a cat hair in my mouth. Oh. <laughs> so I've only doing um, a um, 12 till 8. So that's only obviously 8 hours. Well, 7 and a half, I get an hour, an hour break. So that doesn't really um, bother me too much. I don't mind doing it. That's kind of short in comparison to the shift I used to do. So I'm just making some breakfast and I'm trying this for the first time. Vegetarian bacon. With a, with a boiled egg, with a soft boiled egg on a piece of toast. Never had it before, but I've heard that it's quite nice. So I'll give you my verdict. And if any of you know any other good corn products, because we're Nicole's vegetarian, but I'm going as much meat free, red meat free um, in particular, as possible. So any other suggestions of good corn products or meat free products, vegan or anything like that, let us know because we're trying to branch out and try things that we haven't tried yet. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. So I have a soft boiled egg, obviously, and some of that bacon. It's a little bit charred, but it smells good. It smells kind of like smoked bacon. It doesn't look or feel anything like bacon. And some um, parsley, mushrooms, and light oil. This is this is this is food to keep me going for the next eight hours. I'll take a snack, but I won't have a meal until I get home. Even though it's a bit late, but Nicole has to eat as well. And here we go. I'm home from work, and this is our Thursday night dinner. We have a prawn and corn chicken stir fry with some Singapore style noodles. noodles. It looks very nice, it smells amazing. So good, guys. I wish we had like Smellicam right now. Yeah. So we're both home from work. does that make sense, guys? You know what I mean, right? So you get it, don't you? So yeah, we're just home from work and we're going to eat and chill. And yeah, that's about it, really. By the way, we've got prawns. And corn chicken in here. Yeah, I just said that. Oh, I didn't hear. Sorry, guys. You can, you can tell them again. I can tell you guys again. Yeah, that's We've fine. Got and corn chicken in there. Yeah, so if you didn't know, there's two different things in here. <laughs> Good morning. I am walking the stairs because it's one of my New Year's resolutions. On my way to work. It's my second long day today. So my legs are feeling a little bit tired right now. But I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure I'll make it. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's quite a long way up. <sighs> We've got some lunch today with me. So I've just got like what's it? Some fruit, and then I'm gonna have like a cheese toasty. But I'll try and show you because I didn't show you my lunch yesterday, which was really nice. I had two boiled eggs. Two bits of veggie bacon on brown toast. It was lovely. Really, really enjoyed it. I'll catch up with you guys again in a little bit. So I'm not getting much time for lunch today. Just going to squash a sandwich. Sorry, guys. Thank you. We've got to set the same quarters in my family. Um, my granddad and I were around here last week. Well, it's different times, but a few years ago. So I was just um, trying to see him and my auntie before she moved to Malaysia. And I just thought this looks really nice. There's so money in there and it's donated to the children's hospital. Yeah, we're just walking right back to the car now, about 4 o'clock, it's a lovely sunshiny day, just my mum and my auntie there. My auntie's actually moving to Malaysia, uh, she's got a house out there and she's been talking about it for years, but she's going. So it's really sad but happy at the same time because she's going to have a good life. But yeah, so we're just back to the car now. Hey guys, so I've just finished work, I'm a little bit late, I'm meant to finish at quarter past and it's like half past already. Um, but I am just getting changed. And then it's time for me to go home and see Brooke because she's been out in London today saying goodbye to her auntie because her auntie's going to Malaysia now. She's moving to Malaysia. Um, 
so I'm sure that was quite sad for her. I'm not sure how she's feeling. I haven't really had time to speak to her yet. Um, and she bought me back some pie mash from London. So I will be having that for dinner again today. I'm really excited. And as you guys saw, I kind of just had a cheese sandwich earlier. I didn't actually get time to have anything else to eat either. So um, I didn't get to have any of the lovely snacks that I bought in. <laughs> so I'm feeling kind of hungry right now, but it's a bit pointless eating it now. Um, so I'm just going to get finish off getting changed and get home. So I'll see you there. Fern for Nicole. Oh, my you can't really even see it there in that light. Yeah, sorry, I've got a little torch on it, guys. So you You've see. seen it though before in our vlogs. But it's our dinner. We're very happy. We love our pie mash. Mm -mm -mm. Good morning. So it is Saturday the... Oh, I don't know what day it is, guys. But it's Saturday, so it's the last day of this weekly vlog. Um, I hope everybody's had a nice week and um, is looking forward to the next one ahead. We are, well I am today, catching up with housework. I've got a lot of housework to do, the hoover's out. I've done some washing up, I've got some washing ready to go into the machine. I've got about four loads of washing to do because we've been busy this week working and loads of appointments and things. We've had no time to catch up on our washing. So Saturday is the my day to spend in the house tomorrow nicole will be off of work we have a, um two appointments to go to for exciting things so that would be nice and spend obviously the day together which would be lovely because i start placement on monday another placement so yeah it'll be what kind of we won't see each other as much as we ha has have been since christmas because i've been only at university one or two days a week um so i've been at home a lot more Whereas this time now I'm going to be busy again, so. But it's all good things because it's my last placement of my first year. And once that's finished, my my first year's done. So I start my second year, which is really exciting. Scary because it's gone really quickly. And scary because I know the workload's going to double and get even harder and um, all of that stuff. But I am, I am looking forward to it. And I'm glad that the first year is nearly over because it means I'm one step closer to where I want to be. Um, I don't think there's a lot else to say to you, really. I don't know if Nicole's going to have time to do any vlogging while she's at work. She tries to do a little bit here and there, as you'll probably see before this what, this clip here. Um, she tries to do some vlogging yesterday. Um, this is here, chilling with me. The cats have gone out onto our balcony. It's not too bad in weather-wise today. It's a bit chilly, like a bit when the wind blows, a little bit cold, but it's not too bad. It's quite nice having the door open a tiny bit, just to let in a bit of fresh air. I'm not too cold and I'm in a t-shirt, so oh, that's good. Hopefully it means spring's well on its way and we're going to start looking towards some nice warmer weather. Let's hope so. I think it will get February out of the way in March first, because sometimes they're very cold. But yeah, that's it really. Um, I'll take you along with me today if you have anything good going on. I've got a pop of town to pay some che a check-in that I received yesterday. And yeah, not very exciting for you lot, but you know, as I said, it always will differ. Each day is different for everybody, isn't it, really? One day is good, one day is a bit more boring, mundane sort of household tasks. But yeah, I hope everybody's well, as I said, and I'll see you guys in a bit. New suite. Consider Plum's washable fitted furniture covers instead. A friendly Plum's home consultant will help you choose the perfect fabric for your sofa in your own home. And right now, you can choose from Plum's half price covers too. So transform your sofa today house. for just a hundred and ninety nine pounds. Excuse my cheering. Eight hundred nine five four nine five nine five four six five 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 six five
still got the Hoover plugged in over there because it's going to finish off the hallway. Kitchen looks nice and clean. Taking the bin bag over to the bin shed. Candle lit, just watching some Only Fools and Horses. Done about three loads of washing today, so it's hanging up around the house. It smells very fresh. The cat corner, I don't know what I like to call it. The cat's toys. But yeah, very cosy. Nice dinner, a lovely Thai curry, Thai bean curry with spices, chilies, and some whole grain rice. Yum yum. The whole time. Sorry guys, it's been a busy day today, and then it was really not busy, and we was having chats all day. So I haven't really done much. Luna, here's Nello. Good, Good girl. girl.